Hello Haunters, Yard Haunter 5 here of Steve's Haunted Yard. I will soon be doing a 500 subscriber contest. As of today, I'm at 407. Thank you to everyone that has subscribed. Uh, I know there's a lot of vloggers out there that, that um, tell people to come to my channel. It's much appreciated. Um, I really suck at doing shout outs to each subscriber for the day. I just have too much ADD for that. But thank you, all of the subscribers. Um, I'm going to start also doing, this is a cool update, I'm going to do some standalone videos of the, the things that I build. So instead of you having to go through a vlog that may be titled, um, I Stump My Toe, uh, and then within that vlog will be, you know, a prop that I made. I'm going to go back and do videos of just the prop. So like this guy here is it's haunt Guter done, but there's a lot of other information and stuff that I've logged in that vlog. So I'm going to do a video of just this guy, okay? Of him and then like the motor mechanism and the rocking and the eyes moving and him talking by itself to kind of help uh weed out and it'll be, you know, named rocking chair guy. You know, how I made the chandelier, chandelier, Halloween chandelier how-to, or prop how-to. I'll name it how-to. So I'm going to do standalone videos. Hopefully that'll help out. It's getting closer to Halloween. Maybe it'll help some people get motivated to do that. There are a bunch of other people doing contests. I'm going to do a 500 subscriber contest. Uh, I know there are several other contests out there. JHMDF. Um, he's basically giving away hand jobs uh, if you win his contest. So... Who wouldn't want to enter that? Okay, I know I'm going to enter that. Halloween Hellmouth, he's doing one. He's going to eat a worm. Who does that? Who eats worms? That's just retarded. Uh, the Bloodshed Brothers, um, they're gonna they're gonna down like an entire bottle of alcohol in one gulp or something. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But uh, they're always doing contests. Check those guys out. Be fun to win some stuff from them. I don't know what I, what the prize is going to be yet for my contest. Maybe you could, guys can leave some comments on what would be a good prize. Ferrari Killer uh, mentioned me in his video today. Thanks, Ferrari Killer. I really appreciate that. Uh, your ghouls are kick ass. Uh, so I'm glad that you're keeping them in your haunt. I love the update on the on the hands with the with the stuff. Really cool. Really awesome props. Uh, they're they're really cool. Um, I got some new costumes within the last three or four days that I have not vlogged yet. I'll get to that. Some really cool masks. Some uh, clown masks for the haunt this year. Uh, got some stuff for garage sale today, but it's not going to make it into this vlog. I already have too much on this vlog. I need to hurry up and stop babbling because I want to show you the main thing about this vlog today, and that's mess getting to play with my Udo machine. And I did some uh, screen printed shirts today. Of course, for you it's backwards because the camera on this Apple, when I use the camera on this, reverses everything. But Steve's Haunted Yard dot com shirts. So um, soon, hopefully, I can take some orders. And you can even pick a color of shirt and size and all that stuff, and then I'll make it to order. Once I get so many orders, I'll screen print those shirts. Uh, but I also want to do a TXFX shirt for all you TXFX haunters out there here in Texas. Um, Still be Studios. Um, maybe you'll want one. I, I guess you're, you're in the group. Tomorrow, I'm going to Carlin's house of Terror on Two Jacks. I'm going to hang out with Carlin and Jason of Dark Phobia, uh, both uh, haunters here at Round Rock. We're going to work on the spot. They're going to work on their spider wiper prop, and I'm going to work on later the axe killer door with Carlin. We're both doing one of those. Um, also on Still Be Still Be Studios, um, super awesome Texas vlogger. Check out his stuff. He's making some awesome stuff on the cheap, like really high quality, cool stuff on the cheap. Check it out. Uh, once again, t-shirts. Um, going to. I'm waiting. Uh, Aaron is doing the uh, design. He's going to redesign the TXFX logo as well. Jason sent me a really cool one today that I can use as a one color. Um, I probably won't be able to wait. I'm probably going to do a couple of shirts with that logo. Um, but Aaron's going to 
put a spin on it and redesign it, and he didn't even show me what it looked like. So, peace out. Give me some damn info. Get your haunt on. Hellions. My dream is to make you scream. Stay scary. Get your haunt on. All right, guys. Roll that beautiful bean footage. Making t-shirts. Making a t-shirt for Steve's Haunted Yard, the famous yard haunt in Round Rock, Texas. Yep. This is Aaron Moreno, soon to be famous graphic artist, <laughs> nationally known. <laughs> One hour later. Yeah. Oh, oh my god! god. It's doing something. It's printing! It's alive! Oh my god. It's a piece of paper. How'd that happen? It worked. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it pulled the paper through. Bam! Steve's Haunted Yard. So awesome. Dot com! Step one, complete. Step one, complete. Steve's yeah. Haunted Yard dot com. I know you people are going to want a t-shirt, so get ready. Should I set up a PayPal? <laughs> well, no, because I already have that set up. <laughs> okay, so this piece of emulsion was a fail. Failure. So we're going to try. I, luckily, I cut it in. I'm glad we cut it because that wouldn't have given us a chance to try a second time. So this this piece... For some reason, being in this plastic and rolled up, it was, it had hardened. So I actually had to kind of work it, and now it's soft, and I think it will work. No touchy. So we're gonna give it another shot. He's Aaron's cleaning the screen, and we're gonna give it a give this another shot. Dot com. Oh man, this is exciting stuff. We're the clock doesn't seem to work. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> but it's drying in there. The fan's blowing. The images in there burning or not burning, but drying. Or the emulsion sheet's drying, not the image. Next, we'll be burning the image into the emulsion sheet once it's dry. So my emulsion sheet is dry. I just peeled off the clear layer. I'm going to expose the image into the emulsion. Image is now burning into emulsion paper. Timer is set. It said it takes eight minutes. So once that is done, we will see if the image is exposed and burned. I don't know if you can see that. Yep, a little bit. The image is now burned into the screen. Too cool. All right, I have to I have to wash this thing off, and I will be right back. Okay, I have the image in there. I taped off the space where there is no emulsion. Got my shirt on the plantain. This is a sample shirt. This is a crap shirt that um, I don't care if I mess up. So I didn't want to use it that I just bought until I do the first one. So I'm going to go ahead and give this a shot and see how it works. Steve Haunted Yard. Dot com.